Hey there, how's it going everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you another magnificent program, FDate. In the last video, you have seen Finder program. Finder search the file based upon the name. But consider you don't know the name, you know only the date. Okay, consider you know how many days, consider 10 days ago I have created this, this file. Consider you know, um, uh, between 10 to 5 days I have created this file that file is PDF okay based upon that thing the time duration we can uh, you can search the file with the help of F date so F date is very simple I have written this code in Python and converted that Python code into exe file and you can use this file just like a Windows command finder minus H when I use finder minus H, it will display a manual page. In this manual page, you can see there are a lot of options. Like if you want to know about author Mohit, then it will direct to my LinkedIn profile. And if you want to search based upon second creation time and uh, creation, more, uh, creation minute, based upon minute, hour, day, and date, consider you want to search three months ago. And it became very difficult to calculate the how many days three months ago, uh, six months ago. So you can give date in this format. Okay, with the date you can also set the lower limit, upper limit, and lower limit, like ten days to five days. So you can set limit with L option. And if you want to search a file by using its modification date, you can use minus M here. And if you want to display in the reverse order, you can use minus R flag. So a minus M and minus R, these are the flag with used uh, used with these options. And if you want to just display 10 files, 12, 15 files, you can use minus N. Okay, and let's see how to use this one. First of all, I'm using, I, I need to create a FDate uh, index index file when you press just F date in the will create thread for each drive and then it build the index based upon the file name and its modification date and creation date you can see within 30 seconds it builds an index that index contain file name with its path complete path and then a tuple with creation time, C time, and modification time. For each file, file one, file two, file three, it's time. Based upon these time, we can search the file. Let's see the different commands offered by the FDate program. FDate, when you use V, its current version is three. Okay, now let's see how many file I have created in three days there are a lot of file i have created in three days i'm giving one more option minus m means i want to find the py files dot py files okay if you want to set py should be at the end you can set a regular expression dollar okay now let's see so these are the file i have created just in three days there are a lot of files i have created so I can set a limit so you can directly open the folder open the file and if you have used pen drive or some thumb drive or you want to copy into another drive you can use M for move and C for C for copy okay so I'm not using anything I'm just pressing N okay so CD3 I want to set what are the file I have created in three days to one days means limit I'm setting three days and one days limit okay it's like I'm giving a range of so this, this is current time C time current time and this current time this is third day and this is the first day first day between this time limit I want to find the files okay this is current day first second and third between three to one days okay let's see
Oh, oh. It should be space. Okay, so these are the file I have created this time range. Similarly, you can use similarly you can use H for hours, S for seconds, and D for days. Okay, and if you want to set time, exact time, I just use H option here. It will give you the help. Okay, exact time. It is option for exact time. In this format, you can give the date. So let's see F date minus ET I'm saying uh, 2020 10 uh, month is uh, current like 03 this is a uh, month name and uh, date 28 and time you can give time like this I'm giving exact time in this format 80 because if you provide time there is space you can see so if you are giving some space, so you should provide the codes. Okay. And I'm setting lower limit. Lower, lower limit must be in the same format like this. Means if you are giving a day, so lower limit should be in the day. If you are giving second, lower limit should be in the second. It adopt automatically. Okay. You don't need to give anything. You don't need to specify this is a exact date. This is a day. This is a, it will take the format of et this one okay so i'm giving the date and minus y python files and here i'm setting uh, 28 so these are the file i have written within that day you can see this one is 24 day 24 2020 so if you want to display in reverse order you can just add minus r so i'm getting in the reverse order i'm getting in the reverse order consider you want to search based upon the modification time so just add one more flag m now i'm getting the file based upon the modification date Okay, consider there are a lot of files which are junk file like this one. See, yeah, this is junk one. So you can remove this junk files by providing an option minus E and this one. Now I'm getting less file. Consider I want to remove this one also, learn tag. So you can provide next option with E learn tag you can provide many option many arguments okay command line arguments with minus e so you can see i'm getting the result which do not contain learn tag and c app okay if you want to cut here if you want to know more about the author you can just type minus a this command will open the browser and directly redirect to my LinkedIn ID. So this is my LinkedIn ID. I have written five book and this is the latest book Python for developers. If you want to download the exe file, you can go to our website buddytutorials.com python tips at ftate.php. I have provided the link in the description. So here just clicking this link, click here, you can download the file and you can check the as SHA 256 signature. If you want to see the code, you can go to my GitHub account. So I have recently updated the code F date. Okay, you can see the code. Code is very lengthy. If you want to learn Python, by me you can check the course detail at learntech.org learntech offers variety of technical instructor led courses thank you very much for watching this video if you found this video useful like subscribe and share this video